Hi everyone, it's Jessica. Welcome back to my video. Today is another Yes Style haul and in today's video, I'm sharing a lot of items that are simple and can be worn on the daily. You can wear them at work, you can wear them when you go shopping, just anytime. And if you are putting together a capsule wardrobe, I think these items might be useful as well to add. So um, before we get started, like always, I will share my measurements. I am five foot one which is 156 centimeters tall i am currently 120 pounds and i usually wear size small to medium in u.s sizing and if you are shopping on yes style you can use my discount code jessica U at checkout if you want and with all of those in mind let's get started with the first item the first item is a tote bag this is the tote bag. I have stuff in it right now, so it's a little bit structured, which is more realistic to show you. But I really like this tote bag, and I've gotten tote bags from YesStyle in the past. I would say out of all of the tote bags or bags that I've gotten from YesStyle so far, this is one of my favorites. So this is actually called the Flower Print Canvas Tote Bag. I got it in the style Aster, which is apparently the name of this flower on the bag. And I think the shape of the tote bag is really nice. It is a canvas bag. And there are two straps, which are on the thicker side, which means that the bag is more sturdy and can hold on to heavier items. I love that this tote bag looks so simple. And if you look on the inside, it has a zipper. It has a zipper and it zips really well. Looks like that. And Actually, the zipper doesn't go all the way, so there is a small gap, but it was not an issue for me personally, but I just felt more secure knowing that there is a zipper. And sometimes I do throw in some small items through the gap that I feel like I forgot to put in the bag, such as like hand cream or um, lip balm. I'm not sure if the design was made like that on purpose, but inside the bag, you have a little convenient slip through pouch over here. So you can throw in stuff that you want convenient access to. Like for me, that's my lip balm, hand cream, hand sanitizer, and um, power bank. So just stuff that I want quick access to. At the very bottom, you can just throw a lot of stuff in the bag that you want to carry and I think this is perfect and that I think this is the perfect item if you are a student if you go to work if you go grocery shopping this is just a really nice capacity tote bag that I think a lot of people will enjoy and you'll see me you'll see me styling this bag with the rest of the items from this haul so stay tuned for that the second item of this haul is the top i'm wearing this is the short sleeve plain knit top i got it in the color white i think it is one size fits all so if you're bigger than me not sure if it'll fit but it is a little bit stretchy so it can conform to quite a few body shapes but probably if you're over a size medium in US sizing, I feel like I feel like it's not gonna look as flattering. But I like it on me. Um, I forgot to mention I am a 34B in my bra size, so it does stretch out to that extent. And one thing that I want to mention is that this top is not completely opaque, it is a little bit see-through. So I do recommend wearing a nude bra underneath so that nothing shows. Um, I will stand up for you, but you'll also see it later. This is what the top looks like. And I don't consider myself the slimmest person, but I do really like it. And I'm wearing it with this sweatpants that I got also from YesStyle that are like my favorites. So I love it. Quality wise, also feels nice on the skin, feels really comfortable, so no problems about that. That brings me to the next item of the haul, which is a sweater. This is the round neck striped sweater. So I got it in the striped version. And this is like an almond color. I will put it on for you, but I really love it. I think it is one size fits all, but I will correct myself if I'm wrong. 
this is a really simple top good for capsule wardrobe because you can style it in so many different ways and it's just so simple i think everyone needs a sweater like this this one is actually really good quality it is branded by miss sumi miss s-u-m-e-y and i think i have another item from this this brand from your style and the quality was also nice so i think i will keep an eye out for this brand in the future on yes style when shopping there but this is a really nice soft sweater doesn't feel itchy on the skin and i have really sensitive skin when some fabrics like poke me i get itchy and then i just can't wear the item no matter how expensive it was if it bothers my skin if it feels irritating i just won't wear it looks like this this is the back and I will put it on for you right now. So this is what the sweater looks like. And this is what it looks like full body. I love the length of the sleeve. I like when the sleeve is slightly, when I like when the sleeve slightly goes past my fingertips, it just feels cozy. And if I don't want it that long, I can always fold it or pull it up. But I really don't like when the sleeves are too short because I feel awkward. And I already feel like it doesn't look proportioned with my short petite frame. So I do appreciate the sweater. And I would usually wear it tucked in so probably tucked into the pants and for me that's like a really pretty look and you can wear it in a lot of different ways and i really like this sweater a lot this has to be one of my favorites from this haul so far and of course i will also show more shots of me wearing the items and i'm done standing up for the talking portion from now on you're gonna see the clips on the screen so don't worry about not seeing the item I will show you but to change into them and talk about them at the same time is a no for the rest of the video the next item is a skirt it's a midi skirt it's a so this is the slit midi knit pencil skirt I got it in two colors okay I got it in black and almond this is the black and this is the almond obviously I'll show you both and you'll see both on the screen. Not sure if I'll show you separately or in comparison side by side, but I love them. But um, as someone with a more hourglass figure, someone who's more curvy, I think that it, I feel a little awkward wearing it to be honest. I kind of wish it was less tight. Um, and if it was like a pencil skirt, I kind of wish it was more A-line, something that is not past the knees but since it is a midi skirt you know i wanted to try something new the skirt itself is really good quality it is it's on the thicker side it feels quite warm and it's really soft so the quality is really good and i have to say that i prefer the black one so far because the almond color is a tad bit see-through so if you're on the curvier side and you're really wearing the skirt stretched out to your body it will be a little bit see-through and you will see your underwear so I recommend wearing nude underwear or wearing some tights underneath so that it doesn't look see-through so this is the almond color and the back is pretty unique. There is a slit at the bottom. And this is the black one. Looks like that. This is the back side. This is the front side. So there are pros and cons to both colors. Black is that lint might stick onto it and you'll have to constantly roll it with a lint roller. And I mean, the same also goes for the almond one. But if it's like light color sticking on, it won't be as noticeable. But if it's darker color sticking on, you will see lint on it just a little bit. So not a really big problem for me. Just how it looks on me might not look the best in my opinion. But you can tell me in the comments if you think otherwise. I'm not sure how I feel about them yet. I think they look okay. But for sure the quality feels great. So if you like the style, 
then this is a really good quality skirt to pick up. And then the next item of the haul is a cardigan. This is the v-neck striped cardigan. I got it in the color khaki. And this is one of those items that looked really pretty on the model. So I picked it up and honestly, I like the color and all. Um, but I feel like the color of the sweater I'm wearing right now is a more suitable color for me. I'm not that big of a fan of this color. And also the sleeves are short. So the sleeves hit exactly at like my wrist, which I wish was longer. I wish the sleeves hit at least to my fingertips. So I'm not the biggest fan of this cardigan. And another thing I have with the cardigan is that if you're wearing like a white top underneath or just like any top that, that holds on to lint, I think this cardigan kind of sheds a bit and you will see some lint or some fabric from this cardigan onto the item that you're wearing underneath. So I'm not the biggest fan of this cardigan and not sure I would recommend it, but I think if you wash it and then lint roll it beforehand, it should be fine. But that doesn't change the fact that I'm not a huge fan of the sleeve length. It's a bit too short in my opinion. So I don't see myself wearing this often and I might wear it here and there, but um, I wouldn't recommend it to be honest to purchase. So that is that. And the final miscellaneous item from this haul is a travel skincare kit. This is the Reprouse Essential Blending Body Travel Kit from the brand Frutia. And I've used this brand before and I've actually seen this brand at TJ Maxx, which is a really random fact. But Yesa sent me this travel kit, which is a really nice size to put in your carry-on when you travel. It comes with a body lotion and a body wash. And I can find this really useful if you're going to an Airbnb where they don't provide these amenities. And even sometimes at hotels, if you don't like the body wash or if you're a little suspicious of them, then you could bring your own and this is the perfect size. So this is the body wash and this is the body lotion. I think the size is just perfect and just fits perfectly in your carry-on bag or your backpack. Even if you're staying over at a friend's house, these are nice to bring with you. The scent smells very earthy, like, um, like botanical kind of smell. The scent feels very earthy and light, something that isn't obnoxious. And that's one reason why I really like K-Beauty is because they do a really good job at making their products smell really light and more usable by a lot of people. And if you're curious about the capacity, both products contain 30 milliliters, which is 30 grams of product. So it's really perfect for travel. And that is the end of this Just Style haul. I will make sure to make it not super long. To summarize, my favorite items from this haul are the sweater, the sweater that I'm wearing, and this tote bag. These are my top two items from this haul. Thank you everyone for watching once again. If you enjoyed this Yes Style video, it will really help out my channel if you subscribe and like the video. Thank you everyone for watching and I hope to see you all next time. Bye.